pharaohs of ancient Egypt who built their empire with the help of a grand vizier, Queen Elizabeth II also has a grand vizier who serves as her most trusted advisor. His name is Lord Evelyn Rothschild, and he is the second wealthiest and most powerful person on earth. He is also lord of the world's financial capital, the city-state of London. Lord Rothschild and his ring of power hide their identities behind 13 city council members who stand in as their representatives. On November 30, 2000, Lord Rothschild, now in his 70s, got married in London to a wealthy Zionist businesswoman named Lynn Forrester. The couple then jetted to Washington and spent their wedding night in the White House. Just months before 911, they moved to New York and settled into their 18th floor luxury palace at River House, where two private terraces offered them front row seats for the scheduled 911 show. How rich and powerful is Lord Evelyn Rothschild? Historically, the Rothschild family wealth was hidden in underground vaults. The Rothschild's secret financial records were never audited and never accounted for. Their family commissioned biographies give the illusion that their family fortune has dwindled, but researchers estimate their wealth at close to $500 trillion, more than half the wealth of the entire world. Besides their many castles, palace mansions, wineries, racehorses, and exotic resorts, the Rothschilds bought Reuters in the 1800s. Reuters then bought the Associated Press, which selects and delivers the same news stories to the entire world, day after day. They have controlling interest in three major television networks and easily avoid media attention since they own it. Until recently, they owned and operated England's Royal Mint and continued to be the gold agent for the Bank of England, which they also direct. They control the LBMA, London Bullion Market Association, where 30 to 42 million ounces of gold worth over $11 billion are traded daily. The Rothschilds earn millions weekly just on transaction fees alone. They also fix the world price of gold on a daily basis and profit from its ups and downs. Over the centuries, the Rothschilds have amassed trillions of dollars worth of gold bullion in their subterranean vaults and have cornered the world's gold supply. They own controlling interest in the world's largest oil company, Royal Dutch Shell. They operate phony charities and offshore banking services where the wealth of the black nobility and the Vatican is hidden in secret accounts at Rothschild's Swiss banks, trusts and holding companies. Although Evelyn Rothschild looks like a harmless gray-haired old man, make no mistake about it, Rothschild and his ancestors have hand-picked presidents, crashed stock markets, bankrupted nations, orchestrated wars, and sponsored the mass murder and impoverishment of millions. The wealth hoarded by this one family alone could feed, clothe, and shelter every human being on earth. The reason, therefore, that um, Israel is the biggest recipient of uh, American uh, aid and military support is because this hand called the House of Rothschild takes the money from the United States and hands it to this hand uh, called Israel of the House of Rothschild and says thank you very much. The reason that uh, there's no questioning of uh, um, Israeli uh, nuclear capability that they get away literally with mass murder time and time again is because the House of Rothschild also controls the countries of the European Union and controls the European Union. I mean, Tony Blair is a yes sir, no sir, three bags full sir, how high would you like me to jump sir, front man for the House of Rothschild. So who do they put in after he left the uh, British government as negotiator of, of, of peace in, in, in Israel, Tony Buddy Blair. What shall I say, Mr. Rothschild? Thank you very much. Thank you. That's, that's, thank you. Thank you. And that's it. So when, when you've got the same force controlling all these different agencies, 
then of course they're going to be coordinated. That's why Israel gets away with what it gets away with. And if people think that's anti-Semitic, well actually anti-Semitic means anti-Arab by the way, um, then they'll have to take it and shove it somewhere where the sun don't shine. Because I ain't shutting up about this because it's fundamental uh, to understanding the world and to understanding um, the European Union and, 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 and world events. The Jewish people in general have been mercilessly used by the House of Rothschild and their front secret society, sat satanic secret society called uh, Zionism, as a front which they can hide behind. So it is House of Rothschild organizations like B'nai B'rith, Sons of the Covenant, who created uh, an organization uh, called the Anti-Defamation League, um, which goes around defaming everyone, uh, uh, ironically, um, who have not just campaigned for hate laws that stop you um, exposing these people, they've actually written the bloody legislation in America, in North America, in Canada. And so these hate laws, which say you can't say this, you can't say that, because that's prejudice and all that, they're not there to protect uh, gay people. Uh, everyone to their own, I say, I can care less. Um, they're not there to protect Jewish people or, or, or minorities. They're there simply to stop legitimate investigation of the Rothschilds and its network. That's what they're there for. And um, they are in so many ways the Rothschilds. At operational level, the center of the spider's web. And they need to be exposed because if they get exposed and they go, when I say go, they are uh, removed from their positions of power. Because, uh, to be honest, if they went to, to jail for what they have been responsible for, the House of Rothschild, they would have to reincarnate hundreds of times to complete the sentence. And um, we, we've ignored them, or we've not ignored them, people have ignored their power for long enough because they've brilliantly hidden it. Needs, it needs the, the light shone on it because when they come down, in so many ways, the house of cards comes down. Thank you very much. raining down burns their heads when it hits the ground Good night Rothschild Good night Rothschild Good night Rothschild Good night you off our backs before we suffer more false flag attacks good night Rothschild good night Rothschild 